हेलो फ्रेंड्स सम फर्स्ट प्रॉक स्टूडेंट्स वेर आस्किंग फॉर डिस्कशन ऑन रीजनिंग टाइप क्वेश्चन हाउ टू डील विद सच क्वेश्चन सो वी आर स्टार्टिंग न्यू सेक्शन ऑन आर चैनल दैट इज दैट गोइंग टू डील विद रीजनिंग टाइप क्वेश्चन सो बिफोर वी प्रोसीड वाई नॉट सब्सक्राइब टू द चैनल एंड हिट द बेल आइकन नाउ लेट सी वॉट इज दिस क्वेश्चन बैरल शेप चेस्ट इन एम फाइव सेमा गिव द रीजनिंग बिहाइंड इट लेट सी द रीजनिंग Uh, it starts with chronic bronchitis the emphysema is a progression of the disease that is chronic bronchitis now chronic bronchitis is uh, a copd and uh, you must be aware of this that in copd inspiration is relatively easy but expiration is little difficult Uh, because of the positive pressure during expiration uh, plus the recoil of the system and therefore uh, expiration is difficult what happens in copds like chronic bronchitis is this this is the highlight and uh, the key phrase always should be highlighted early closure of airways during expiration it means all the air that went in during inspiration cannot come out during expiration because of early closure of airways and because of the early closure of airways some amount of inspired air gets trapped the air getting trapped beyond the uh, constricted airways closed airways so this kind of small small amounts of air are getting trapped uh, gradually what happens is there is destruction because alveoli are over distended so there is destruction of the alveolar septa and then chronic bronchitis will progress uh, to the uh, emphysema now what is happening is air trapped beyond the closed airways and therefore uh, there is increased residual volume obviously uh, air is getting trapped beyond the closed airways so residual volume increases and gradually because of that the total lung capacity also increases that's a key feature of emphysema increase in the total lung capacity now you imagine that the lung capacity overall total lung capacity is increasing and therefore gradually slowly over a period of time uh, it results in a uh, changed shape of the chest the shape uh, i mean because of the over distension of the lungs the barrel shaped chest is the result if if you can see just diagrammatically it's a quite a distended uh, lungs and therefore a barrel shaped chest uh, you have to imagine a wooden barrel and then that's the reasoning behind uh, uh, the barrel shaped chest in emphysema we are going to discuss all such reasoning type questions lots of them on our channel and therefore do subscribe to the channel